Well, hi right, everybody. Doing the what if Miles Morales could get a character of his own, but not only have he sp stolen Spider Man, he's also sp um, st stealing Captain America and Wolverine. But I'm not gonna say, but I'll try and do this quick though. But anyway, you see, like by the first one of Captain America, the drawing is pretty crap. It's not all that good. It's one of them where the female Falcon. She's flying in real fast, either to do a shit or to take a selfie or just to get in frame of this front cover photo shot. But either way, it looks corny in that. And uh, Miles Morales and all his crutch area, it looks tightly wrapped. But Wolverine, though. The black spandex is coming out and um he's got four claws and can travel in time through dimensions apparently because he's just in space but I don't think that's true but anyway to the article by Games Radar what if Miles Morales is a new Miles mashup series. What if returns in March with what looks like Marvel's favourite new trope? Yeah, of getting other characters to be like Miles or Miles Morales to be other characters. But anyway, update following a teaser image apparently showing a mashup of Miles Morales and Wolverine's release earlier this week more on that below Marvel Comics has announced the next title in the publisher's What If reveal which has brought back the title of the classic series which explored alternative takes on popular heroes and stories as a brand and all its own encompassing multiple titles like the publisher's first new what if title Spider-Man Spider Shadows don't, don't know what it's about but um, it says here though which sh um, shows a world where Peter Parker never gave up the Venom sim symbol the next title in the line focus on Spidey but a different one yeah I don't know but anyway in, in this case as implied by the Wolverine mashup the new title is what if Miles Morales in which Miles will follow in the footsteps of a different Marvel comic hero Besides his traditional mentor, or mentor Peter Parker, becoming the successor of a different hero in each issue. <sighs> the first issue from the writer Cody Ziegler and artist Paco Medina. Ask what if Miles Morales became Captain America? It shows off pretty much exactly that on its cover from the Sarah Pickel. Yeah, and it, it was crap. I don't, as I say, don't know who's drawing it, but what I think though is is the like total wreckage done by rioters 
or an earthquake or some natural disaster or is it Miles Morales rioting for Black Lives Matter? I don't know because I haven't read the comic but anyway. Future issues of what if Miles Morales which begins in March will include a mashup of Miles Morales and Hulk. So it's going to be Hulk. I don't I don't know what they're going to do there with the colour when he changes. I don't know if... And I don't know if he's going to have like an afro and all. I don't know. But he's also going to be Thor where I don't I don't know what what's going to happen there. He's definitely not going to have blonde hair. I know that. But and as a preview below Wolverine, yeah. Stay tuned to Newsarama for Marvel's full February 2022. So uh, coming later this month and um, for updates on March what if Miles Morales yeah. Marvel's new what if line of comics is getting its second title a mashup of Miles Morales slash Spider-Man and Wolverine apparently Marvel released the teaser image with the title what if promising more information on November the 16th which was like a few days ago and that it says here and that that but and the title itself will debut in March 2022 as Newsrama previously reported the recent Spider-Man Spider Shadows is the first in a planned line of what if titles Marvel Comics is publishing considering with the Disney plus what ifs animation series so it's going to be probably getting the anime Chip that is Zick guy who wrote Spider-Man Spider Shadow has said he is working on a second what if project and that could convincingly be this new title and although Whatever is being teased is presumably is an alternative universe title. It comes just as Miles Morales has found himself in scarky ground regarding the Spider-Man identity shared with him by Spider-Man. In November the 10th, I think that's 10, but they put 10s, but no, in November, or it could be November's 10th issue, I don't know, but Miles Morales, Spider-Man, issue 32, the Beyond Corporation, who obtained the Spider-Man trademark in a shady deal, saved Miles with papers, saying he was <laughs> illegitly using their Spider-Man brand well yeah so from fighting crime it's to fighting trademarks but anyway if he's not a Spider-Man maybe he can be Wolverine or maybe Black Widow or maybe any other character that they want to do they're probably doing all this for the like computer game so if they don't computer game next now with Miles Morales they can do Miles Morales as Wolverine, Miles Morales as Captain America, Miles Morales as a Hulk, as Thor and all that but yeah uh, it looks like he's already in innovating with the number 
of course he has whilst the original Wolverine is known to have three claws on each hand Laura Kennedy that's Wolverine's daughter thing and Deccan are best known for having two claws per hand the Wolverine villain Romorus has four claws on each hand but with one of them coming from under his wrist not from top of his hand like the Wolverine and now seemingly Miles Morales and yeah so yeah, look for more on this here at Newsarama Marvel loves mashups I bet they do and the illusion of change and it looks like 2022 is being set up for another of them yeah of them crap ideas that they can't really sell and so they just try and hop off other well known characters names but if you don't like Miles Morales here we go Sparta Gwyn becomes the entire Marvel Universe in new Gwynverse mashup event and variant 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 covers and then if you didn't like that there's a real gaily back girl Babs Tar returns to Batgirl for one night only in Batgirl number one variant cover so they've got a lot of variant covers but yeah well I'll leave it there so thanks for watching cheers bye